Yeah, the nickname, uh, you know, in the beginning, everybody wants to give you a nickname. They want to call you Killer, or uh, I had some funny ones in the beginning. Short story, uh, my first one was a hazardous hillbilly. That was one. Pillow Hands Holtzman was another. Lay your head on my pillow. Uh, killer, all those. So I didn't want any of those. So I had a friend that I worked with at the time. I was sitting in a cubicle uh, doing all, the whole business stuff and uh, called me, uh, started calling me Hot Sauce because he noticed every single day, every meal, I put hot sauce on something. So. He came to the gym to start training some jiu-jitsu and, and started calling me that and it, it kind of stuck. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure uh, what the exact date was when he uh, claimed the nickname, but I, you know, I didn't know he had it for a long time. And people started telling me pretty recently that uh, there was another hot sauce in the UFC. So, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll have to see if, uh, if we can both keep it. We'll see. Uh, eggs, hash browns, uh, avocado, rice, chicken, fish, hot wings, uh, lasagna, spaghetti. Ooh, guys, I'm killing you during during a weight cut. I know. But. Yeah, yeah, man. Everything on the buffet right now. Speaking of weight cut, uh, got vegetables. I put it on. Um, what else? Jeez, quinoa. I put it on. Hamburgers, hot dogs. <sighs> Anything, really. I mean, that's a tough question for me. Yeah. Oh, man, I think number one go-to is Cholula. I love Cholula. Good all-purpose. Uh, Frank's. Frank's a good one. Uh, there's some called Tennessee Lightning. I like that one. I'm partial to it. Um, and I get people sending me a lot of crazy ones. Uh, but Texas Pete's a good one. Texas Pete. And uh, let's see. I like the Tabasco Chipotle, too. People send me bottles of hot sauce for all, all over the country. It's crazy. I'll get you know fans from Louisiana will send me special stuff. So I get a lot of specialty hot sauce. It's good. And, you know, I had a guy send me that owned a uh, ghost pepper farm. Sent me a whole bag of these fluorescent red ghost peppers and wanted me to eat them. And uh, I had to draw the line on that one. Oh, yeah. Top, top five. Let's see. I really like functional nicknames. And I, I think... Uh, you know, nicknames that fit guys' personalities. So I'd have to say, uh, ooh, California Kid, I think that's a good one. Uh, Cowboy is a good one. Uh, Evil Eye, I like that one, it's catchy. Um, God, who else? I think Stefan Bonner, the American Psycho, he's not in the UFC anymore, but that, that one's pretty fitting. And uh, Smooth Benson Henderson, I like that one, of course, I'm partial to that one. 